We're back. Good morning. So we woke up today. We are feeling super good. Fever is completely gone. Feeling great, so I think we're good for our trip. Sickness is pretty much gone. But today we just have some work calls. I started my work day earlier so I could end a little bit earlier. And then we're just gonna pack and get ready because we leave tomorrow for our trip. So that's the plan today, we're just gonna pack get things ready, get the car loaded up as much as possible. We're actually dropping crew off at Kenley's parents tonight since we'll be leaving tomorrow morning. They're gonna be watching him for us throughout the week just while we're on our trip. We didn't wanna bring him just because Lake Powell is kinda hot and difficult with really little kids. So we figured it'd be best just to let him stay with his grandparents. So that's the plans for him. He's starting his fun week long sleepover with them tonight. And then, yeah, we leave tomorrow morning. And Crew's favorite thing lately is being in his walker. He loves it in there. Huh? I think he was in there like all day yesterday. Can you say hi? dropping off crew at my parents and then we are um, at the store now just getting snacks for the road tomorrow and some drinks for the week getting all the snacks Ooh. best thing about vacations is we eat what we want we got the goods secured good morning it is early and we are on our way to Lake Powell. Well first we're going to breakfast and then we're gonna pick up our friends in Provo. They're gonna ride with us. We're gonna try to fit all of our crap but we have so much stuff. <laughs> yeah it'll be 10 days total that we will be out and so we gotta get all of our crap but yeah, we're excited. We're gonna stop so and get gas and everything and hopefully we can get there by a good time. We're gonna try to be there tonight. So here we go. So we are at IHOP for breakfast. Got some OJ to start our morning off. Nutritious breakfast. Mm-hmm. All right, so we also picked up our friends, Jacob and Ashley. We went to pick them up in the switch car, so they picked us up. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> But we just stopped for lunch at Iceberg. All right, we had to make a pit stop here in Beaver to meet the Beaver, Phil. <laughs> yeah, apparently this is like a top 10 Denny's in Utah somehow. I don't know how they measure that. So we had to stop and take a picture with him because a sign on the road told us to, so. All right, so we're at this cool rock shop checking out some of these rocks. Up. What? <laughs> what is this?
And then it's like they put you in the water and you're like all in your own. Paradise is gone. I don't get out! What is happening? Where's my pants? <laughs> Mom, what are we doing? Captain Brian, captain of the ship. Beach babe. <laughs> His name is uh, Francisco Atanasio Dominguez. Go ahead. <laughs> Good morning. But well, we're at Lake Fowl, and today's the actual day we'll really vlog through what a normal day looks like. So we've done breakfast already, cleaned up bedding. Now we're going out on the boat surfing. And we are that's pretty hyped. much it right now. All right, so we've just been surfing and playing games today, eating lots of food. We are on the houseboat, and some of the boys are digging a hole, so we're gonna go take a look at the hole. Yeah, so a lot of the day at Lake Powell is just hanging out, swimming, snacking on food, playing games. Literally the most chill vacation you could go on. Some nice teriyaki chicken. Do you have really? Those? No, we don't have an Insta Pot. You eat so I awesome. Maybe that's what I need. Put like however many cups of rice in, and then yeah. same amount of water, so not like normal rice. And then you just high pressure cook it for 15 minutes and it's ready. Perfectly cooked. It's Look at this. What do you think, Dax? It might be easier to get up to this point this way. Yeah. Just hiked all the way up to this nice viewpoint. Got the sun setting. There's a houseboat where we're staying. And this is the bay that we've been swimming and boating in. And the rest of the lake. Pretty cool. All right, so we just had dinner and we are gonna go night surfing. <laughs> and then <laughs> probably just hang out and play games after that. All right, today is race day, so it's intense. There's only gonna be one winning team. Rody. So cute. Hi. Oh my gosh. <laughs> And the winner of 
of Lake Pal Survivor 2023 is drumroll, please. Oh, All right, well, it is the last night at Lake Pal, and if you can't hear it already, this is basically what we do the last night at Lake Pal. water <laughs> drink responsibly stay sober <laughs> all right well sad day kind of because we are now leaving lake pal the houseboat is on the move we are almost back to the marina you can hear the engines running but we had a super fun trip I haven't been able to shave as you can see so excited to get home use my own shower sleep in my own bed and get to shave but super fun we're also super excited to get home and see crew so we are on our way to um, pick up crew. We just got dropped off in Provo where our car was at our friend's apartment. Um, we were riding home with them from Lake Powell. We are so sad to be home from Lake Powell because we had so much fun, but we are so excited to see crew. Okay, so we just picked up crew and we have so many things <laughs> in the car. I can't even believe we believe we fit it all. We were like, we're not gonna be able to fit everything. We're gonna have to come back and get some of this stuff, but I'm glad we did. Now we're gonna have to go home and unload everything, which is the worst thing to do after vacation. Especially and after a fun one like this. Yeah. Oh, you were so happy to be home. I missed you so much. Yeah. Things are unpacked. We've got the laundry going. We're just getting settled back in at home. We're back with crew. He's in bed actually right now, trying to fall asleep. So yeah, we're just gonna hang out for the rest of the night. Tomorrow's Father's Day, so it should be a good day tomorrow. But we had so much fun on our trip. Make sure you like and subscribe, and we will see you all tomorrow.